Greetings friend, entrepreneur, and fellow business builder. I'm marketing master Jim Ackerman, and this is Biz Kaboom's Good, Bad, and Ugly Ads. I'm about to show you a marketing specimen and ask you to vote on whether you think it's good, bad, or ugly from a marketing effectiveness point of view, and then I will give you my verdict on whether I think it's good, bad, or ugly. And this is an interesting one. You know, sometimes it's just the presentation. Sometimes the presentation can be as important as the substance of what you're talking about. Take a look at this presentation. I'm, before I open this brochure, and I'm calling it that for lack of a better term, I'm going to show you all sides of the brochure. When I say all sides, that's important. Normally a brochure has a front and a back. But this brochure also has a spine. Look at how thick that is. Now, some heft to it as well. And there's a reason for the heft. Behold. 37 seconds left, Al Wester. This is the football game. Young signaling something from the line of scrimmage. First and 10, Brigham Young on the Missouri 14 yard line. Running play, Stanette to throw, throws it back to Young. How about that? A video and a brochure. Now, it goes on to tell you a lot more in the video about what it's all about. And if you look at it on the inside, and if I open it up, it's going to play again. But it gives you some instructions over here. This is a fundraising video. It's a computer inside the brochure. You've seen something like this when you buy a card at the store that automatically plays a song, for example. The technology is available to do this kind of thing. There's only one downside. It's expensive. You tell me, is it worth it? Is it good, bad, or ugly? And just take a look at some of the video once again. 37 seconds left, Al Wester. This is the football game. Yeah, I'm you're back, and you have seen a video brochure. Uh, these things cost over $100 a piece to produce in small quantities. You can get them down to over 50, but less than 100, obviously, if you buy them in large quantities. But they have to be quite large quantities to get them down there. So is it worth it? That's the question. Is it worth it? Well, the answer is, yes, it is. You obviously don't send this to every patron, everybody who might give you some small contribution, but to the big guys, the big guns, the guys with the big money, this kind of a thing can be very effective and has proven very effective in this particular instance. It helped Brigham Young University raise hundreds of thousands, maybe millions of dollars for their athletic programs using Steve Young, a famous uh, BYU alum, uh, as the spokesman for their video piece, and then being able to deliver something that's entirely different from anything a potential patron has ever received in the past. The bigger question is, is the presentation worthwhile to use in other kinds of settings? And the answer, of course, is probably yes. For example, I have a jeweler who does all her own designs and there's a story behind the designs. What if she buys just six of these and uses that as a tool for her salespeople when people walk in the store? If there's a big lineup of people, they can be handed one and be watching the video while salespeople are helping other people. Or the salesman can pull it out and show, let me give you the story behind this piece and that kind of thing. There's all kinds of uses for this kind of technology. But the point I'm trying to make once again is presentation can and does matter. And if you present it well, even if your story isn't the best in the world, you can have a great influence on the people to whom you make that presentation. So. The marketing master's take on this one is good. Love to hear your comments, what you think, and you know, I recognize you might not be a BYU fan. I'm talking about the marketing here. Love to hear your comments, the comments of your friends. Don't forget to subscribe and continue to think outside the box as you build the marketing systems of your business and continue to attract more customers who will pay you more money 
More often, the fastest, easiest, most cost-effective ways possible. You get it all right here on BizKaboom and Good, Bad, and Ugly Ads.